Good evening, I'm Anna Manuel. The Lamar County School District has reached a settlement in a vaping lawsuit against two companies. It comes as a local organization is raising awareness about this growing trend among kids. Fox 23 senior reporter Quintus Jones joins us with details. Uh, that's right, Pine Belt News is reporting the school district reached a settlement for $78,000. The suit was against two companies they claimed were targeting children with vaping products. They say this allegedly led to vaping among underage children. As you know, this has been a growing trend in recent years. The problem so bad that many organizations have taken legal action. A recent report revealed one in five high school students admitted to vaping in a survey. Doctors say it can be harmful to children by affecting their developing brains and overall health. It can also lead to nicotine addiction and even respiratory problems. Nicole Banks is an advocate with the Mississippi Tobacco Free Coalition. Her goal is to raise awareness about the harmful effects of vaping because she says we don't really know what's in these products. Take a listen. A lot of times I don't think that the adults understand that youth are mimicking what we do. So we have to be a good example even though we don't know what all is involved in vaping. We have to be an avenue to educate young people on what harm it actually can cause to their body. Now for more resources on the dangers of vaping, we'll post a link at myfox23.com. Cornish Jones, Fox 23 News, Hattiesburg.